Pisces, what in the Dungeons and Dragons is going on with y'all out there? It's been a little minute, it has. But I hope you all are doing well, feeling well. You know what I mean? And um, we're here to concentrate on the Pisces energy. So for Pisces people, for the cross watchers who want to investigate what Pisces got going on, you're all welcome. If you just want to know where the Pisces energy applies in your natal chart, your zodiac chart, you're welcome. You're welcome. All right? I may cuss, but I don't curse. And I'm going to keep it a bean with you, though. You know? So, I mean well, but I'm going to keep it a bean. And, uh, going to do a three card draw, right? And going to be drawing about the nature of a situation followed by your attitude towards that situation. And lastly, a card that shows a significant factor related to that situation. So I ain't going to hold you long. Pause. This is the nature of the situation at hand, Pisces, and the Pisces energy. Ace of Wands, something fiery is being introduced to you. It's a new beginning. It's something new on the horizon. Um, this is good news. This is actually great news because what I'm getting here is you ask the question, you pose the question, what thoughts produce actions? What thoughts of yours actually cause you to move to take action? Because you have a lot of them. Let's just be honest. You know what I'm saying? You have a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot of thoughts. But which, which ones actually got you busting the dope moves out there? That's what this is. Whatever it is, those types of ideas, that's the one that's getting passed to you. That's what's inspiring you to bust the moves. And this may be, it's not may, but this feels new. It feels like a maybe a new passion altogether. Um, this is you actually accepting a gauntlet. Not like that either. Not like truly going to war, but getting into a competitive field of some sort. You like, fuck it, let's get to it. And you're excited about that because this puts you in the game. This makes, this solidifies you as a player in the game. You understand what I'm saying? Not only that, um, what helps is your knowledge base. Whatever knowledge that you have regarding or revolving around this industry, this entrepreneurial thing I'm even getting, really excites you even more because it's like, yeah, I know what I'm, I know what I'm doing. You know what I'm saying? I know what I'm talking about. I know what I'm doing. Like I'm knowledgeable on this. Like so, even more of a reason for you to get behind the inspiration. So keep that in mind. It's those thoughts that creatively sparked you to actually take the action. Not the other ones that is like, oh, I got to do what I got to do because it's not those. That's not what I'm talking about. But let's see how you feel about this situation, Pisces. Yeah, more bond energy. It's six of them now. It's six of them now. We cooking. We heating up. What do you Listen. All right. You're going to be celebrated for this. You're going to be celebrated for busting the dope moves that you're inspired by. The thoughts that have you actually produced the action. So for people who say, and I've heard this before, and I've also experienced this, so I'm not saying people are wrong, but there's always a lot of talk about Pisces saying stuff and not doing it. It's true. Um, but this is where you get to prove them wrong. Because finally in your life, this is something that it says, you know what? You've taken the better look at yourself to ask it, ask the question, which of my thoughts actually produce me to act? Right? And not for nothing, this may come from other people. Pause. But it just will. Like, it'll come from other people. Like, they'll inspire you to do this new fiery thing. And they like, yo, you know you do such and such great. Or you look good doing this. Like, yo, do this. Like, you ever thought about doing this? And you're like, oh, shit. I should do that. Matter of fact, I did that three years ago. I stopped because, because, because. Why? Because you had to do the mundane. The things that you had to do to pay the bills and get by. Now you're like, hold on. I'm going to cut that bill. I'm going to cut that bill. Or I'm going to just take away the time that I use spending on those bills. Sometimes it's not the money. It's just the time that you expend on those other things. And you're like, yo, I don't even want to do that shit no more. 
because what thoughts produced those actions? It was just some additional mundane shit that actually goes with, I guess, the reward of doing mundane shit. And that's why you were involved with it. So now you're like, man, X that, X that, take that off the calendar, take that off the calendar, take that off the calendar. I'm doing this shit now, and this is going to bring you success. You're going to have victory in doing this. You're going to win. And I don't see haters. I see well-wishers. I see supporters. So get out of that mindset. Oh, people going to hate me. They Look, that shit come with it, but I don't even see that here. Unless it's in the next card, Jesus. But let's see a factor to consider regarding this situation, all right? A lot of fire energy out right now. A lot of fire energy. Yeah, you're going to give back to the hood, man. And maybe not necessarily the hood that you were raised in or, you know, the impoverished area. But you're going to find out a way to actually show some type of goodwill based upon your success. Based upon your success. And I, I feel like you're going to give back to areas where people are inspired by other people. Where people are inspired by other people. Where people still actually look up to people who do the right thing. Who say, yo, I see you doing X, Y, and Z. You could use a A, B, and C. And then you get the one, two, three, and you just like, yo, bars. You just like, fuck that. Let's put all this shit together. This shit is popping like it's beautiful. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, that's what I'm seeing, B. The sharing of gifts. You're gifted? I'm gifted, too. I know you see it. Yeah, I see it. They actually say, yeah, I see it. Like, you're good. Like, yo, you're good, too. And it's not no fake shit. Because the hate is real. So I get it. You might be, like, trying to detect people's radar. But you got radar. This Pisces shit. You know when someone's being gem genuine and when someone's trying to bullshit you. So with that being said, I hope y'all enjoyed this video. I'm out of here. Till next time.